Uh, Shark Boy. Uh, well, he's on the list, and he, he took some shit. He keeps he keeps <laughs> maliciously attacking. Drive bys. I think it's uh yeah, they're drive bys. They're inappropriate. They're uh they're um, they're vicious and they're yeah. um, and they're, they're slander. You know? Those are vicious. They're malicious. You know. Yes. So does he have any extra heat because his son it might be the homecoming king and because his son was wearing a Pac-Man suit with a tie, with a matching tie? So basically, Shark Boy tweeted uh, the similar thing that, um, you know, when Joey Janela and Enzo had that despicable, violent <laughs> encounter after the uh, Blink-182 show. I had to turn away. It was so violent. <laughs> it's a violent, that, that, that violent encounter. Uh, so, so Shark Boy tweeted that I go, "Hey, Hootie and the Blowfish is in town. It might be a good, uh, like a good place to fight or something like that. How about it at the Real Disco or something like that?" And I tweeted, "You can go to that show with your dumb kid." All right. <laughs> well, so, I, so I've officially on Twitter referred to his kid as dumb. All right. <laughs> and uh, so I've thrown shade at his kid on Twitter. It's a fit. I always keep thinking when I hear that concert because it was Hootie and the Blowfish and like some rap. Uh, who was it? Who was the other guy? No, it was Blink One Eighty Two, and yeah. uh, uh, was it um, Lil Wayne? No, um, I was like, yeah. Shit. Could any of them be- have been there to see Lil Wayne? But anyways, whoever it was, I, he just quit the tour. Yeah, it was Lil Wayne. Yeah, yeah. 